Hi everybody, welcome to Julie's Crochet, aka Julia. Today is Whip It Wednesday. This is the first one I've done in a while. I did do a live yesterday if y'all want to go check it out. But I'm going to read a devotional and then I'll show you the whip that I'm working on. And it says, Sinking Even Lower. Manasseh did evil in the eyes of the Lord. He sacrificed his own son in fire, practiced divination, saw omens, and consulted mediums and spiritualists. Manasseh led the people astray. 2 Kings chapter 21 verses 2, 6, and 9 Accounts of how evil we human beings can be are horrifying. Concentration camps, suicide bombings, ethnical cleansing, human trafficking, and those are the big scale things. What about behind closed doors? Alcoholism, incest, pornography, rage, shame, people destroy their children and their spouses as well as themselves. Manasseh was a master of evil who during his 55 year reign led God's chosen people to abandon his holy ways, placing idols and altars to false gods in the Lord's temple. Manasseh was guilty of much evil in the eyes of the Lord. 2 Kings chapter 21, verse 6 But before we feel even a twinge of holier than thou, we need to remember that God doesn't rank sins the way we do. Our cruel words and unspoken kindness, our envy and anger, our jealousy and self-centeredness offers us up close and personal evidence of how evil we human beings can be. We are blessed to have a long-suffering God, but our just and righteous God is angered by sin and he will judge. Okay, so with it Wednesday... I've been designing a steering wheel cover. So I'm going to show you that. I have designed one for things we're making Thursday that I've already finished. But I will show that in tomorrow's video, a picture of it. Because I, I have it in my car and I don't want to keep taking it in and out. So but this I'm making for my fiance's birthday. His name is Timmy. I know some of y'all know him, but he wanted a new steering wheel cover because the red, white, and blue one I made him, uh, it's probably been about seven, eight years ago, it's starting to get a hole in it. So, his favorite color is green, and he has a 72 Chevy that's about this color, so I figured I would use this green color. It's It come from um, a Dollar Tree. Just my yarn or something like that, so I think's the name of it, but I don't know the colorway. But this is my own pattern, so I can tell you what I did. I chained, let me get my notes. I got it back here somewhere. All right, <clears throat> I chained 135. And then after you chain it, you go back, make sure your chain ain't twisted here. And you connect it to your first single crochet. And you're just crocheting around and around and around. This measures about 28. I like to make mine tight where you don't have, where it don't slide. So... It's about 28 inches long. You have to do the width first, or the length. And then I'm going to do the width, about four and a half. And then I'm going to put a border all the way around it and do, um, what is that? The crab stitch. And I do have the crab on the one I will show tomorrow in the picture. So I will show you that tomorrow. But this is what it's looking like. So, I, it'll stretch pretty far to go around the steering wheel. So, and it is cotton, but the one I made for mine was in a uh, wool. Um, uh, let's 
be. I thought I had a thing with him. What it was. I don't remember what I did with the thing, but it was, um. Oh, it's, um. Dang, I had it on the tip of my tongue and I can't get it out. No, oh, I can't remember now. But this yarn right here is what I used. I know I have it in one of my other videos. I just can't remember what it was, what in it. But it's not acrylic. So, um, but I will show you the progress probably Friday because his birthday's Friday. And I'm going to try to get it done before Friday. And I, he likes chickens. So I got a package of little chicken buttons. Or if I can find the one that's out. There's one that's out of the pack. Yeah, it's a little chicken. And I think I'm going to put it around the front. I think he'll like it. For his birthday, he will be... 60 years old, his birthday. So, I'm going to try to get it done. Tomorrow is uh, Things We're Making Thursday. So, I can start making my videos regular if I feel good. But one of the other reasons is because I had to take my son's girlfriend to school every morning. And then I had to pick her up every evening. And now she's out of, out of college, rather. So, now I won't have to do that, and I can make my videos. Most of the time, I was just so tired because I get I got up at 4.30. I couldn't lay down and go back to sleep because I had to go get her. And then I'd try to lay down when I come back. Now, either I always had something I had to do, or I had to go help somebody else. And then my videos got pushed because I couldn't, I couldn't do everything and then go get her and all that. In the evenings, he's here, and I spend time with him, so I don't usually make videos in the evening. But, hopefully I can get back on schedule, if y'all can just bear with me. So, if you can, please uh, subscribe, and like, and leave me a comment. I do read them all. And I hope everybody has an awesome day, and please be kind to others, and be kind to yourself. Because we all do need to show kindness, and we all enjoy being showed kindness. So, I'm going to leave you with that, and I will see you in the next one.